All right, I thought I'd start the video here. This is a really cool area. We're in Moab, Utah right now. You can see the giant Colorado River. And currently, we're doing some rock climbing here. Just some crazy scenery in Pliss, man. If you guys haven't been to Moab, Arches National Park and Canyonlands, you should go. But I'm gonna hopefully catch a few lizards. We've seen some, but I haven't spent much time trying to catch them. Probably won't really be able to find any snakes. Um, but it's okay. We'll find some lizards and be back in Colorado in a little while. Find some other herps there and for now I'll probably just show the land here. Alright, so due to pretty bad weather this time, I haven't been able to see really any lizards yet. But take a look at our campsite. We're all the way down there and just this view, man. All right, so I just added those Moab clips because it's a really cool area. Um, but now I'm back in uh, Colorado. I've been back for like a week or two. And we got a little bit more snow, but it's been warming up pretty good. And right now it's after school. Me and Hayden are going to hit some places around us and hopefully turn stuff up. We've seen, uh, seen turtles on logs and seen a few frogs in the last few days, but not any snakes yet. Um, except for the ones we saw at this one spot like a month ago or something, but we're gonna see what we can find and hopefully we can get some results. Alright, so Hayden just found this Plains Garter snake right here. All, as always, oh wow, this one has uh, some nice green in between those black dots on the side and of course that nice orange stripe. But uh, so, so far the only species this year we have found is Plains Garter Snakes. Um, but they're still, they're still cool, anything we'll take. Um, but we're just gonna let this guy go back into the rocks we found it in. And even though it's really good weather, like in the 70s, since it's the beginning of the season, it's still gonna be slow even when the weather is great. Um, but it'll pick up slowly, we'll find more stuff. And we're looking forward to it for sure. Um, gonna get in picture and then we'll release this guy. All right, y'all. Still haven't released a snake. Hayden just had a super close call with this nail sticking out of the board. It went right into the side of his shoe. That could have went right into his foot. You need help taking it out? Oh, nope. okay. Lovely. All right, so when there's pieces of wood lying around, watch your step. That, that, because that could have been bad. Yeah. But yeah, still gonna release this guy real quick. so backlit from this angle. <laughs> All right, so one of my goals this year is, oh, this this minnow is bugging. It's spinning, it's spinning around every time it swims. But one of my goals this year was to not worry as much about getting dirty and going for catches and turtles and stuff. And I mean, kind of did that right there. Just got this red-eared slider. There's also a koi fish. I don't know if you can see that orange tint, but there's a giant koi fish. We haven't really looked at this pond before, but this red-eared spider ended up being slow. And uh, yeah, first turtle of the year, red-eared slider. A nice, oh, there's got a leech. Let's see if I can. Pick that leech off. Maybe, yeah. Might try to get it in a bit, but. Got a red ear slide right here. We'll see. I'm probably gonna set it down, see if we can get its head to come out so we can get a better look at it. But it might not, and we'll just let it go. But so when I said that minnow is bugging, that's what I was talking about. This I don't know what this guy's doing. Um, obviously something has went wrong with it. It came to be a big minnow, so it was fine at one point. It's probably got. Something happened to it. There was there's tons of minnows here though, and they're all fine except for this one. But probably some side sort of parasite or something. But I'm just gonna let let nature do its thing, and it'll probably become food in a bit. Um, but we'll, we'll release the turtle here. Gonna set this guy back in the water. Sad sad that this pond is kind of trash. You can see there is a lot of trash in here, but there's still stuff doing fine. Come on, bruh. 
All right, well, he'll come out of his shell in a second and keep swimming around, but we're gonna keep on moving. All right, so I was just by those rocks over there. I walked around and because uh, we had seen a turtle on the rocks. There's a few more, but they bounced before we were even over there. And uh, it was sitting on a rock. Before I even could get too close, it went into the water. Um, but then I just saw the dust cloud was in between these two rocks. And I, I didn't think that it had went any further, so I just felt in between the rocks, stuck my hand in there, felt the shell, and was able to grab it. But we got another red-eared slider right here. This one had really nice red behind the ears, but now it's staying in his shell. But it has a lot of nice yellow as well. Some really good colors, actually. A little bit of moss, but the rest looks really solid. Um, but uh, do we want any pictures, or should we just let it go? I might get one. All right, we're going to take a few pictures, and then we'll let it go. All right, we're just going to let this guy go back into the water. This side of the pond is definitely cleaner, at least less trash, so that's good. Oh, did you see? The red popped out for a second, but it's some really bright red. But uh, we'll probably come to this pond more, just because several turtles and caught them without too much difficulty, considering we don't have a net. Um, but we're gonna keep going. It's getting later in the afternoon, it's like 5.15. Uh, but maybe we'll be able to find something else. All right, so earlier we saw that weird fish, and now we see a prairie dog eating another prairie dog. I'm not getting too close because it's just gonna get scared away, but that's a dead prairie dog there getting eaten by another prairie dog. I mean, it probably died from something else, and now the prairie dog's eating it, but geez, that is two weird things in one day. But we got a few herps, so. That's good. But we're gonna keep going, that's weird. All right, so I'm biking home. Uh, it's six o'clock now, so it's pretty late in the evening, but it's still good temps. Um, but I'm glad the f weather has finally gotten good. Um, still a little bit slow on the snake sides of things. Looks like the turtles are out. Um, saw frogs and still got that one snake, but uh, not too bad for this early in the season. Gonna try somewhere tomorrow where we haven't been before. Um, but I think for now that's gonna be it for this video. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.